What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Animus J here, and I told y'all I was gonna get Fallout, man. I'm super excited. This game's gonna be so dope. As you can see, I already made my character to save some time. So let's get right into the action and let's get this series going because we're going back to the wasteland and it's time to do it. Let's go, everybody. All right, so we are starting off straight from where we ended. As soon as you make your character, the screen pops out. We are good to go. This is Nora. Hey, hon. It's Nora, our baby right here. We love her. Uh, it looks like we are not in the wasteland yet. It looks like everybody's doing well. Uh, so I don't know where we are. This I think it's going to be a great turn from them from Fallout 3 where we started straight in the wasteland. We didn't know what happened. So it looks like they're going to kind of give us the background story of this, which would be really, really nice. Uh, let's see. So, you know, we're going to go around. We're going to activate this dryer. Yeah, let Codsworth see that. <laughs> Actually, there's nothing in the dryer. You know, I'm like all Fallouts. There's always things. Abraxo, for all your... Oh, um, there's always things that will that you can find throughout the game. So, that, that, that'll that be very important. So, let's just go around. This is a nice little house here. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this radio. Oh, this old-time radio. <laughs> we really need to get those vacation photos developed. Cut that radio off. Cut that radio off. Nobody want to hear that. Cut that off. <laughs> All right, so let's see here. Got some sweaters. I don't really have much of a style. It looks like my guy's uh, dressing style is pretty bland. War we have <laughs> we have uh, this this green war outfit and then a white. It's not, yeah, my my guy has no class. So we're just gonna close that out of, uh, out of the embarrassment of us not having any clothes to wear. <laughs> because oh look, it's a baby room. So look, it's our little baby. What's up, little Sean? Let me play with your boy. How you doing? Haku Jeku Jeku. Okay, so let's keep on looking around here. Hey, here's our special book. I don't know if you remember this from Fallout 3. I wonder if this is how we can wonder what work our specials. Actually, not. We can't. But um, I see this is a, def a definite reference. If you play Fallout 3, you were actually the baby. Who actually looked at the special book and that's how you started building your stats so that was really really cool so that's nice nice to see that little um that little reminder he's gonna learn how to drive so i don't think that's much in this baby room our blast radius I, i've never heard of that game in my life uh <laughs> but it seems like that might be like a little foreshadow blast radius oh uh, i see what you did there but that's the i see what you did that's what i'm talking about all right, wifey still getting dressed. So we're going to go ahead into the living room. Ah, What's up, man? Your coffee. 173.5 degrees Fahrenheit. Room to perfection. That's up. And today's newspaper just delivered. Well, thank you, sir. Let me get a sip of that Joe. Thanks, Kazuo. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Grognack the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Ah, our character is a comic con guy. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so we're going to look around. We're looking at the... What year is this? I thought this was like set in the... in the. Well, I guess that happens later. I guess I'm, I guess I'm confusing my... <laughs> Thank you, sir. You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. I don't know how I feel about letting the robot hold my baby. Thank you, sir. I have a high of 52 on Monday. Hun. We should take Codsworth to be service soon, don't you think? Looks like there's nothing going on in the kitchen. Open the fridge, ready. Give me a nice beer. Get some of that new cola. New Coca Cola. Ice mm, cola. Mm, mm. And some soft berry steak. Saddle up sounds pretty <laughs> steak. Graded A plus. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. He comes for you every day. Hello. What you want? Do it in my house. Good morning. Vault Tech. Hello. Vault Tech. What, what you want? Vault Tech. Remind me again? Why, we're about you, sir, and helping secure your future. You see, vault is the foremost builder of state-of-the-art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. 
luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally mm -hmm. speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. You won't. Urgency. Uh, let's see. Well, you know, <clears throat> for me, whenever I play these games, I always try to be like the good guy, the guy who try to like talk people over it. So I, I won't, I won't be the jerk. Um, I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of those out there. So we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna stick to what I'm good at. We're gonna stay a good guy. <laughs> Not going to. Uh... Then I'm glad you caught up with me. <laughs> oh, me too. You have no idea. Now I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a. Uh, hmm, Precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault one eleven. Okay. Vault one eleven. Uh. But there's room for my entire family, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot. Hmm. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> <laughs> I see that foreshadow. Oh, uh, tell me more. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it mm -hmm. has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. Okay. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. All right, cool. Let's, let's sign up. Sure, let's do it. Splendid. Splendid. Now, uh, let's see. All right, so this is the registration form, which this I think that's pretty awesome how they led that into... Let's get in stats. You remember Fallout 3? There is uh, quite a bit of stats here. Um, it looks like the same ones from Fallout 3. Uh, so we got strength that will make us stronger, more power, how much you can carry, the damage of your melee attacks. We got perception, um, your environment awareness, and the effect weapon accuracy of your VATS. Which VATS is the slow motion. I think they it used to, Fallout 3 was pretty much stop time. But I think now it's a slow motion aspect. Which makes you have to play a little bit better. Um, endurance is your physical health, your total health, and the action point drain from sprinting. Charisma is your ability to charm and convince others. This is usually my stat um, because I always like to try to talk my way out of things. I think it's a great way to affect your success to persuade and dialogue and prices you when uh, you barter. So you can make more money in that way. Intelligence is a measure of your overall mental um, acuity and affects the number of experience points earned. That's also another great one to have because then you can level up a little faster. Ability is, I say, uh, agility, sorry, it's to measure overall fitness and reflexes. It affects the number of action points in VATS and your ability to sneak. That's another one I use because I like to uh, sneak around and get critical damage. So charisma, intelligence, and ability are usually my three that I focus on. Luck is the measure of your general good fortune and affects the recharge rate of critical hits. So we are going to focus most on Charisma. I'm going to put Charisma at a high 10. Um, actually, we don't have that many points. So I'm not going to put Charisma at a high 10. <laughs> We're going to put our intelligence up. We're going to put some to Agility. I want Agility to be kind of around 5. Um, that way we can sneak around a little easier. Uh, let's see here. Luck. Critical points to be, to be important. We'll put Luck on 5. Let's see. We can't, we can't balance everything out, so something's going to have to give. I was kind of seeing how balanced we can make our character. Um, but let's, let's actually take, let's put luck on three. Charisma would be on six because talking is going to be key for me. Experience points is going to be key, so we're going to put that on four. Perception, I'm not too worried about that. Strength, I don't do a lot of melee attacks. Uh, so I'm more of a, I'm more of a gunner kind of guy, so we won't, we won't focus too much on strength. It is the amount of stuff we can carry, but that's okay. We won't worry too much about that. Uh, basically, what we saw with us being able to build our own house and our town and stuff, I'm not too focused about that. If it's total health and action points drain while sprinting, we'll put endurance up to a six. We'll take charisma to a seven, uh, and we'll put perception 
to a two. I, I think I like this. I think I like that. So yeah, this is the stats we're gonna go with. Our main focus be able to talk our way out of things that gives you extra dialogue, extra background. I'm all big about story, so charisma is always um, important to me. Intelligence is important, gives me a little more um, experience, and then agility allows me to sneak around. So these are the stats we're gonna roll with. I'm super excited. Let's go ahead and keep going. Uh, you must name your character before proceeding. Oh, I completely missed at the top. Okay, so here we go. Of course, we're going to name ourselves. I like to play myself in these games. Um, that way it feels like me. So, James is the name that we're working with today, ladies and gentlemen. Wonderful. That's everything. i uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. <laughs> Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price. That's right, high. baby. <laughs> Good answer. I have mm -hmm. my moments. Oh my goodness, what's wrong, my baby? Mr. James, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to call me. Hmm. I think he needs some of that paternal affection. You heard Codsworth. So, I don't know if y'all just heard, but he actually said my name. That is so cool. No Fallout game ever been like that. You've never had an identity like that. That is so awesome. Um, that he actually said my name. So, I am very, very much a fan. <laughs> Again. What's up, Sean? What's up, little man? Come here, buddy. A little giggler. Hey, wifey. Hey, you play with the you play with the kids a lot, huh? Yeah, girl. We should make another baby. We're gonna make another baby. <laughs> no. Hey, how are we, guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Okay, so you wanna spend a little time? We can watch TV instead. Uh, let's see. Sounds fun. Yeah. Like Let's do that. Sir, Mom, you should come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? Uh oh, what's wrong with my little robot? Wait, what's the door? Oh, here's the door. Why did you shut the door, girl? Hello, anybody here? Followed by, yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Wait, what? We, we need to get to the vault. It's time to go. I've got Sean. Come on, baby, get, get out the door. Run. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate. Oh no, they starting us straight from when it happened. Where's my kids? I'm coming. Go, go, baby. Ah, uh, no, no, no. I've, I've seen a lot of these movies. You don't help people, you just run. <laughs> Let me in. We're in the program. Let me and my kids in. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay. That's right. Thank you. Come on. You two Come on. Come on. What's gonna happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Run. Step this on way. the platform in the center. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Hold on to Sean now. We on. Almost there. We're going to be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you, too. Oh! Oh, my God! Oh! <laughs> but take us down! Take us down! Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> that, that was crazy. Oh my goodness. Oh. What's happening? What's happening? We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. This, this doesn't look better. If we left a minute later... No, we'd no. all be Don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Hmm. Everyone, just head up these stairs and... Yeah, this doesn't look... Better. <laughs> better way of living. Just throwing it out there. <laughs> Excuse me. Why don't talk to me? Hey, Peter, man. Welcome to your new home. Up the stairs, okay, so you just don't care. You okay, sir? What? What? What's going on? Excuse me. We, we just okay. Excuse me. All right. Come on, Noah. Come on, Sean. Call me. Welcome home. Hey there. Hello there. Once we seal the vault, we'll all be getting to know each other a lot more, I'm sure. I don't like what that sound. <laughs> I don't like what that sound. Over there. Take a seat. Now just head down the hall. Yeah, looks fine. Hey there. Welcome to Vault 111. How long they been down here? Why they talk like that? A little creepy. What's this? Bag chips. It's down uh, the hallway, right? Thanks. There. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Where we going? I want that on your arm. Give me your arm. See, this is our new home. It's terrible. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that. Orientation. Just a few <sighs> medical items we have to get through first. The vault stated to start checking everything all this before it's coming to vault. Prepared for the future, right? What is with all this mess? Where are you taking me? Just step in here and So you want me to step in there? Sean, you okay, baby? Okay. Right here, here, Sean. See? It's okay, boo boo. Who's my little guy? Could you I'm not going me? far. That's I'm right. Over it's there. okay, Sean. There he is. See? Daddy's we'll be all right. All set. Just step inside. So you want me to go inside this this death machine to put on the suit? Why can't I just go here in this corner and change it? Oh my God, honey, honey, you be safe, okay? Going in the soup. Going in the soup. It's decontamination. Don't hurt me. Oh, I got the suit on already. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just here. relax, he say. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Baby. Occupant vitals. Normal. Baby. Procedure complete. In five, four, what? Three, So confused on what's happening. This is the one here. 
Hey. 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 What are you doing? No! I will, I will kill you. I will kill you and every piece of soul that you walk on. What? How could you? What? What? Oh, I'm so pissed. I'm so pissed. We got juice and water on that. I'm so mad right now. The anger is real. The anger is real. Let me out of whatever this thing is. Where am I? Out of time. Started, baby, baby. Come on. Has to be a release. Uh, I can't open this. Open. Come on, come on, come on. Oh God, baby, forget leaving. I must save her. So they froze this. I'll find who did this, and I'll get Sean back. I promise. Okay. Got this red ring. I can't believe he just killed my wife. Like, they froze us for who knows how long. I'm put it back in. Make she rest. Rest in peace, baby. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I will murder that man. Get me out of here. Inaccessible side door. Side uh, I got a door over here to the left. I don't see anybody in there. I'm like peeking, looking around, like, where am I at? <laughs> Alright, so. Ew. Ew. What is that? <laughs> Hope I don't go. I don't have to go that way, do I? Safety first. No, me. I'm gonna check this out. Let's see here. What's this all about? Uh, okay. So reading a little background story. It seems like they was running out of food. Things were going bad, and the overseer locked everybody out. Just reading some of the the words on the uh, computer. I decided not to put that on here just because you know I wanted to save some time. Not make y'all watch me sit here and read the computer. Uh, let's see, what's in these file cameras? We took, we took some cigarettes. This game is so beautiful. Oh my goodness, I am loving the way this game looks. All right, so we're gonna head through this sliding door. See what we find here. Nothing of importance. I'm so nervous. I'm so mad that they killed my wife, yo. That's so, that's so pissy. And then they took my boy Sean. I'm, I'm gonna murder that man. I'm glad. To, all right, so now I can finally start attacking. Looks like Fallout 3, we got the cockroaches back. We're gonna take the security bat and batoon, baby. Come here! Stupid little cockroach. Huh? Huh? Giant roaches? What Give me that roast know? meat. Man, gotta eat. <laughs> See some of this water. That's what I'm talking about. Sipping on that water. Where that water coming from? Giant roaches. Ew. It's always the creepy part of the game. Big old nasty roaches. All right, so we're gonna look around a little bit, see if we can find anything. Fallout is all about detail. If you play any of the past ones, you can find special things by looking. So we're while we play, we're just gonna kind of check everything. I'm kind of sure there won't be anything early like that in here, but I mean, why not look around, see what information we can find? I am a journeyer, man. I I I will search a place up and down 
I'm trying to figure out if I found something or not. Okay, so that's sliding door. Look in the kitchen. This game has really started off really strong. Um, we're going to take that hot plate. It started off really strong because I was not expecting to lose anybody this early, which really sucks. Uh, gosh, man, I was... This is crazy. This is so, such a different spinoff from Fallout 3 where you, you, you're kind of going through the life in the vote. And here, they kind of just start you off like hardcore, which is which is amazing. Oh, this is where all those roaches were. Keep your eyes open. I'm um, assuming we probably shouldn't go down there. <laughs> That's just this lightning bolts shocking the ground. Probably shouldn't hear that. And then that roach didn't make it or died. So we just go ahead and round it. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this red roach. Left trigger's the block. Okay. Okay, the block has a woo! I got that. <laughs> woo! That was the best surprise. Okay, so the block has a you can't hold it. Oh, um, it's kinda like a little time thing. <laughs> I don't I don't think they made it. It's active. Let's see here. Where is everyone? It looks like People have died. See, we got a battered clipboard. We're going to take that. I don't, I don't know what it's for. But right now, we're going to take anything that we can uh, because they might come in handy later. All these roaches. RB is the power attack. Okay. Oh, that takes a minute to swing up. Come on, what you want? What you want, roach? Huh? Huh? You want to end up like your cousin? Mm. Give me that roast meat. Man, I'm hungry. <laughs> Okay, so you got your basic attack, you got your power attack, and then I can block. Alright, health is on the left, AP is on the right. Hello? Hello? Is this all that's left? Oh, look, we got our first gun. Okay. We got some pistols, we got some ammo here. So our pad is our weapon. We can press A to select it. All right, so I'm gonna focus on the pistol right now. I'm gonna take everything we can get here, take all these bullets. I saw something pop up. We are gonna take wonder glue and a flip lighter. I'm gonna grab all that here. Nice. I want that. Coming back later for you. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, the same my dad did. I want that, but he had to have a match to unlock. Um, I think that goes towards agility, which is uh, which builds up your unlocking skills. Um, uh, if I have to say, so uh, that might be a good thing. I think it was like that on Fallout Three. Maybe wrong. We're just gonna keep looking around, trying to collect all this stuff, because I am not a strong person. That is not how I roll. I will pop you before I uh, walk up to you and let you beat my face. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, there's no need for me to come out here and be looking like that. All right, so we got a bobby pin. I think if I remember correctly, bobby pins are used to pick lock stuff. Pre-war money, pencils. We're grabbing whatever we can because it's all about customizing. So let's head through this door. Y'all ready? We're Terminal what? somewhere. Terminal. Oh, okay. So it's probably this computer right here. It would make sense. Oh, I almost missed them stem packs. Stem packs is our way of health. Uh, eyeglasses. We're going to take these eyeglasses. We're gonna take this battery. I don't have a pit boy. Uh so how do I equip this stuff? Okay, so we'll just go through the overseer terminal and see if we can get up out of here. There's a lot of stuff here. Confidential. Okay. I read that from the last one, so we're gonna open evacuation tunnel. Remind all staff to orderly follow shutdown protocols. Uh, oh wow, protocols before exiting and reselling Vault 11. Please maintain all staff records and research. Report to your local Vault Tech superiors for debriefing of and further instructions. So now we have the door open. Uh, we can check out the overseer log. See if there's anything important. Uh, I think the only one that will be important to me is mutiny. Have turned on me the man that they allowed to leave the vault. Idiots. I wouldn't I would not open the door to ear death. If people don't like it, well, that's the few mouse to feed. Alright, so there was some kind of um, mutiny that happened. People probably got tired of him and they decided to put an end to his tyranny. 
All right, so we have our pistol now. I hear you. I hear you, little cockroaches. I'm gonna go ahead and pop this one. Pop this one in the face. Collect that moolah. Oh my god! Oh, oh, there's so many now. Ah! I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Stop biting me. <laughs> Leave it alone. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. I'm terrible. I'm terrible. Oh, I can slap him with my pistol. Didn't know that. <laughs> That's so disgusting looking. Guys, they didn't have to make them so realistic. That is so creepy. That is pretty disgusting. Give me all this red meat. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is so terrifying. Got to reload this pistol here. Okay, so... Uh, X is to reload. Okay, nice. Learning all the specs here. Roaches seem to be my biggest problem. My health is a little depleted. Looks like each time we get hit, we did get some radiation. I think that's new. I think I don't think when you fought things, you got radiation. I think being in certain areas, you got radiation or eating certain things. Um, so this is why I focus on stealth because you can do more damage, avoid bright lights, and use melee attacks to remain undetected. To perform melee attacks, uh, wielding the gun, press RB. All right. <laughs> So it looks like we may take advantage of the melee attacks a little bit. Um, you know, my goal is to find a silencer. Did anyone get out? Yeah, try to figure out how to get out of here. This is like this is the vault entrance. Uh oh, I heard something. Stupid roach. Okay, so I'm just gonna pistol whip all these roaches and save my bullets. Ah, we got our first pit boy right here on the ground on this dead man's arm. <laughs> What a way to get one. That is crazy. I think it looks beautiful. It looks nice. Well, I mean, it does look beautiful, but, I mean, but it's a pit boy, so it has to look beautiful, right? Like it. Like it. All right, so we now have our first pit boy telling me there's some copyrights initiating. There's a little pit man. What's up, Mr. Thumbs Up? I think their logo is so awesome. Uh, change tab with right and left trigger. So we're working with our stats. Looks like our body is fine when we are at level one, about almost halfway. We have two things. Uh, this security bat, uh, batoon, uh, batoon won't be my uh, my love there for that long. We are doing out of town, out of time. That is when we finally unfroze and we're here. So it looks like they show you all that fun stuff. So a bunch of quests. Here's the map. Here's a radio. So let us go back to what we do. So we now have the pit boy. Uh, we are at the vault door, but I, I think this is the way out. Find out. Vault door cycling sequence initiated. Please stand back. Yes, 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 ma'am. <laughs> Oh, so much dangerous stuff awaits on the outside of this vault door. <clears throat> I am not ready or excited. I wish I'd be excited, but with me being a big chicken, I heard something. <laughs> I know that's going to be a lot of not fun stuff out here that wants to eat my face. Who wants to hang with stuff? That, woo! That is a bright light. How do I, here? Oh, okay, I was like waiting for it to open. <laughs> I was expecting it to open itself. Okay, so, let's see, we're going, we're heading out this vault. I'm ready. Take me back to the world. Take me back to the world, I'm ready to go. I'm coming home, Betsy. I'm coming home. Hello? Hello, how I get up here? Do we want to change anything? Uh, let's go look at our attributes one more time. Since stealth is gonna be important, since I, I have realized this now, I want to change my endurance because that gives us more health. I want to change it and add it to strength. That way we can have a little bit more power. So um, I'm gonna change that up just a little bit. Perception, not to worry about that. 
and I think I think this actually may be good. Agility, number extra points, ability, sneak. Yep, I think this might be good. Let's let's roll with this. And let's head to the vote. Oh, let's exit the vote. What's up guys, if you like the video, think about subscribing, this, this channel is all about having good, clean fun. My goal for the Fallout is to, from here on out, is to show uh, different quests. So they won't be as long, but I definitely want to at least show the opening, give people an idea about what the game is about before we get into the quests and stuff, and kind of give you a good background about Fallout. So I hope this video gave you a good idea about it, kind of gave you informative, and maybe even made you want to buy it yourself. And I hope you really enjoyed the video, and like I said, if you did like it, um, it's awesome, man. If you'll subscribe and just join this awesome family because we just love having fun. So I'll catch y'all on Friday, and I can't wait to see you again. Take care, everybody.